I've been in the tree service industry for 10 years here locally in Grand Rapids uh, and in business for myself for the last five. I started out just like everybody else, tending rope, uh, dragging branches, feeding a wood chipper. My first thought when I hear electric chainsaw is weakness. Just can't cut the tough stuff, you know, that a gas powered saw can get through. The Ego chainsaw is surprisingly powerful for how lightweight it is. first thing I noticed when I squeezed the trigger was the power that was right there. Uh, it will really chew through a branch. It seems to be an extremely safe saw to use. There is a two controlled initiation for the actual chain power. Um, you have to have the side button pushed before the trigger will engage the chain, which is crucial. I've been impressed so far. I've, I've been in a tree now climbing for most of an hour. Obviously the saw is not running the entire time, but I'd say we've cut 20 branches, uh, some of them smaller in diameter, some of them quite larger in the four to five inch diameter range. Uh, we're going on an hour and the battery has not slowed down yet. Uh, the power to weight ratio is what makes a difference in a saw and for, for how light the Ego is, it is surprisingly powerful. For something with a portable battery, um, with a sharp chain, it does the work uh, of any small gas powered saw uh, in that weight class. The number one advantage that I can see to the Ego is no more trips to the gas station. No more trip to the hardware store on Saturday morning for two cycle mix, just one jug of bar and chain oil and electric battery and you're ready to get to work. And there's no gas to store inside your house so you can take it right down in the basement, put it up on a shelf and there's no winterization which is another huge benefit.